why is it that when so many people play gpo they always complain about the pointless grinding and they always complain about everything to do with gpo but where is the actual problem a lot of people say everything is a problem the progression is a problem but i'm here to tell you right now that it's a progression now the progression is the main culprit of why people do not like gpo as much as other games so let me begin GPO has a very very intense and grindy basically a leveling system so to go from level 1 to max you have to spend hours on hours to just get to that level but this is designed intentionally so people spend longer in the game and so people are have a, so the game can con maintain a higher player count a higher you know average playing time and get more money and get you know discovered for you know have being the most engaging it's in games where you can basically afk in and where you can basically spend a lot of time in and usually those are anime games and these anime games are designed for you to sit there for hours and what this does on roblox when the section of roblox where the game section is you can basically see games that are the most engaging and so there's there's a couple of sections on the you know front page of games where it's like most popular it shows the most popular games the most engaging meaning the most time spent in the game and the most you know etc etc like some most like you know liked or most you know paid for like whatever most money spent in and so a lot of these games what they try to do is they try to do stuff to keep you in the game for longer that allow you to afk they maybe make something very slow they allow you to do it like basically a whole afk and a lot of stuff like that now here's the david gpo when they developed the game they were saying oh instead of making a fun progression system where people could level up you know with enjoying themselves i'd rather focus on keeping them in the game as long as possible while making quests super long and since we as people when we start something we usually want to accomplish it and get to the end of it so we don't like starting something and then leave it halfway so even if something is very very grindy we still want to beat it at the end of the day and that's that's how deep walking is in a way so let me explain what deep walking how deep walking works and how it relates to gpo so deep walking if you never played it before is this primitive game where you have to grind up to get yourself to level 60 and get yourself a bell now deep walking has a system where you wipe correct and so if you wipe you lose all your progress now here's the deal let's say deep walking is as grindy as gpo in terms of you have to just run around kill a bunch of mobs avoid getting caught by other players because if you do you'll just be resetting your progress and starting off at the beginning i spent like 60 hours straight just grinding and i probably have like a hundred hours total on all my slots and i know that's a little so there are people with 1000 slots but i just played until i got maxed and i quit so for me to go from level zero to learn the game to become max and have a bell, it took me 60 hours or I'd rather say 100 hours. One slot was six hours and 100 hours another. Regardless though, let me explain why this relates to GPO. GPO is as grindy as deep working, but the GPO doesn't have this thing where you can die permanently and lose all your progress. Because if you did, that suck and it'd be super difficult. But listen. People want to accomplish games, so just like Deep Walking where you want to get your belt so you can quit the game and not play again until a new update drops, that's how GPO works. GPO is intentionally super grindy and makes things very difficult, that's why they have 1% drops, you know, so you have to keep doing bosses over and over and over again so they keep you in the game and you'll do it because you want to accomplish it, because you are a person who doesn't want to leave things out. I want to get this because I want to accomplish it, because if I don't, I fail the wherever I'm a failure, right? And that's the kind of mindset most people have. They want to accomplish it no matter what. They spend hours in the game, even though they don't enjoy it. They don't enjoy it, but they spend it because they want to feel accomplishment. They want to feel like they did stuff. They want to feel like they worked hard and got themselves the reward. That's what people want. And so that's what GPO is abusing. And which is why people play GPO a lot, but hate it at the same time. Because people want to feel of accomplishment. Because they're not finished with the game. Because if they're finished with GPO and there's no content left, people would immediately leave and drop the game. Which would happen to Deep Walking. That's what my rant about Deep Walking was about. 
As soon as people reached maximum deep walking, they immediately stopped playing the game and left, which is why the big drop in player count is evident because initially it was high for a couple of weeks and then it dropped. And it's because of naturally the game didn't couldn't keep the place because people got to max and they stopped playing and they'll come back when a new update drops just like GPO. And so that's how GPO and Deep Woken are similar, and that's what the problem with GPO is and Deep Woken at the same. Because both are grindy, exploiting, or accomplishment center, I guess you could call it, because we want to accomplish games so bad, even if we don't enjoy it at the same time. And that's all I wanted to say. Check out the video I made yesterday where I was talking about, I believe, all seeing eye.